episode today we're reviewing the legend creation Titanfall atlas class titan so let's get into it okay now i just want to open the box so i can see that titan i got so as you can see you've got some shots of the figure on the side and the figure itself with the pilot and the weapons and everything you need so yeah that's just wait for box just remove it. Okay, we got that. Now you have the Atlas and everything that comes with it in the plastic shell. Okay, so let's remove it from the plastic shell. You've got the pilot. Look at that. The IMC pilot. Which I think he has a core SMG problem. And we have the XO-16 rifle, used by Mo the Monarch in Titanfall 2 and BT. Look at that. Looks pretty nice. Now we have the plasma railgun. Ah, yes. Northstar uses. It's like a sniper. That side. The other side. Yep, that looks very nice. Now, we have an extra hand, which is I think is for... Holding the weapons, see, because the hands are not movable, sadly. Let's put that away. And now we get Atle the Atlas class Titan out of that box. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. It's a Titan. Very nice. I love it. Now let's talk details about the figure himself. The Atlas looks really nice. I love it. I'm my first Titan. It's not a 3A, but it looks nice. So as you can see, it's got the normal Atlas face, looks pretty cool. When you open this, you can see the cockpit. It's got a chair, but the pilot is not movable, sadly, because he, now he, but he just can't fit in because he's not movable, sadly. But it's really nice details. That looks nice. Then we come down to the chest, the legs. The legs look fine, they look good. This is obviously an IMC, uh, Atlas Class Titan. I think the paint job looks good, but the paint quality not that great. And uh, we come to the side, you've got the hand, you've got the Apex Predator symbol right here. Okay, you've got the legs from the side, the hands. The hand looks nicely detailed from the inside, the palm looks good. The back, you've got the boost where he just dashes, you know, just dashes. You've got the back of the legs, looks good. And also, you've got here just a bunch of cables, electric stuff, wires, just out right here showing. And I think the details on this figure is really good for how much it is. Okay, now we get to look at the pilot. Uh, the, the paint, the details aren't that great. The plastic is, I don't know, it doesn't look great. The model just doesn't look good. You know, they could have done better with the paint. And then I would say, this is a really good pilot, although it's a statue. But it's really bad, I don't like him. And we get to the XO-16 rifle. Right there. So you've got the uh, magazine. Let's just move this. Let's just focus on this. So you've got the magazine, which holds the ammo. You've got these pieces, I don't know what it is for. You've got the optic. Looks nice, very cool, that's a lot of details. You have the handle. XO-16, and that's it for the XO-16. Now we get to the plasma railgun. As you can see, it's just the nor just the normal plasma railgun. Looks nice from the sides with the silver, black with the brush. All of that looks amazing. But from the other side, yeah, looks pretty nice. That's basically it about the details of everything that comes with this. Okay, so uh, the way you pose this, you pose the pilot is you just, you just put him like this. Come on. Come on. Yeah, like this. So now he's just helping his friendly Titan, you know, destroy others. So you got the side. That back. The other side. Looks nice. And now for the weapons, you get this specially made hand that's made out of plastic because it doesn't move. I'm really sour about that. I don't like it. I just want movable hands. Uh, this piece file. 
Good, okay. So, let's just put this. Okay, so what you do is just bend it to your liking. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. Come on. Okay. Let me just put this in. And ta-da, you've got the hand holding the gun. Looks cool. Okay, now let's just put it on. Oh, this piece just keeps on falling. Okay, let's remove this hand. Okay, you got that. Now he's got no hand. Oh no, where's my hand? Okay, so now, let's put that in. Yeah. Okay, that's in. Uh, not that far in because the hand is really stiff, but you have him holding the XO-16. Running to destroy a bunch of titans. Man, looks pretty cool and he's just falling around. Okay, it's fine. Let's just get that on to fix that piece. So yeah, you have the XO-16 on him. You can put him in multiple poses. He will look really great. As I've done, I've put poses of him on my Instagram. If you want to, just just go down to the descriptions. Just click that link. And then you find my Instagram where I post all of my pictures. So you've got this side with the XO16. The other side with the XO16. And yeah. Now, we're going to do the Plasma Railgun. It's really, really long, as you can see. Really long, because it's supposed to be a sniper. With like North Star use. I hate North Stars. Oh my god, North Stars. <laughs> they just snipe you and you and your teammates from somewhere from the map. Then when you find them, they just run away. They just dash away. Really annoying. Okay, now let's put hand here. Okay, we got that in uh, really hard. So let's just push this in. Come on! Okay, come on. Okay, so it's in there. Um, the hand's still stiff, but it's really long, and you can snipe people with it from halfway across the map. Now let's measure the size of everything. First thing, the Atlas. We just make him stand straight. We take all that because that adds more weight. Okay, push that back. Okay, now everything's good. Now let's measure him. Okay, so he's around 23 and a half centimeters tall. Okay, here you go. Can you compare that. Oh no, he was about to fall. Okay, you just you just lean back. Now we measure the uh, size of the XO16 rifle. Now, see that? That is going to be around 14 centimeters long. Come on, this piece just keeps on falling. Okay, let me show you. Okay, 14. Okay, as you can see, 14. So now, let's measure the plasma rail gun. A really long sniper. So let me just see. Around 20 centimeters long. Here you go. As you can see, around 20. Oh no. As you can see, around 20. Now the pilot. Put that back. Okay. So the pilot from the foot till the top of the head is around 8, and a half, eight centimeters tall. Okay. Wait, just just hold on. Okay. Come on. Okay, as you can see. Eight centimeters tall. So yeah, that's basically it for measuring the length of everything. All in all, this figure is good. The quality isn't the best thing. The quality isn't the best thing about it. The paint quality isn't that bad. Uh, it's not that nice, but it's not that bad. 
Although, I love Titanfall, and this can be compared to Joy Toy figures. Joy Toy figures are 10 times much better, like in quality. Just a lot much more better. But hopefully in the future, I get the 3A Atlas Class Titan, and everything would be fine. So thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and follow my Instagram if you want. See you guys next time. Peace out. Make sure to stay safe. I'm <laughs> sorry.